Hey guys, this is Madison Starman. The European Space Agency, ESA, is lying about being aboard the ISS International Space Station. This fraudulent crisis acting astronaut, Tim Peake, is pretending to be in space. Now, I want you guys to take a look at this picture. As you can see, there's a British flag hanging up because this is a message to Her Majesty, which is revolting enough on its own. But as you can see, everything in the back behind him is only a green screen. He never moves. He never engages with any of the items. He just stands there, you know, allegedly in space and zero gravity. A couple of things I want you to pay attention to when I play this video is the fact that nothing moves behind him at all in any possible way. Um, you know, the only thing that moves is him and he barely moves because I believe he is hanging upside down, being suspended by cables and in front of a green screen to give the illusion of weightlessness. His sleeves, I'm actually going to have to show you his sleeves in a minute. Let me let this play and then we'll go ahead and stop and discuss the sleeves. Your Majesty, this is Tim Peake and welcome on board the International Space Station. I'm truly honored to have received Your Majesty's message inspired by its wording and humbled to be able to represent the UK and Europe on board the ISS. You liar! This guy is not aboard the ISS. Look at his lying show face and look how red it is right now. The reason why it's red is because all that blood is flowing to his lying weasel eyes <laughs> and is making his face look red. Look, you can see like veins popping out and stuff. You know, it's obvious he's hanging upside down. This is the thing I wanted to talk to you guys about, about his sleeves. Look at how tight that sleeve is. All of the videos allegedly from the ISS, their sleeves are like this. The reason why is because if they had normal sleeves and they were hanging upside down, it would be obvious that they're hanging upside down. Instead, they have their sleeves tight to their arms, and so, you know, they don't move at all, and it gives him the illusion of dangling in space. We'll go on. I can tell you it's incredible to look at the British Isles for the first time from space. What a liar. Our islands and our nation are a special place to me. And I hope that the next six months will demonstrate to everyone across the UK and Europe how international collaboration and brave endeavor can change our world for the better. Okay, he said for the next six months he's going to be in space. All right, here we go. We know that they don't bathe in space. I've already covered that in the last video. So here are his armpits that are being like suffocated by this sleeve. Look at this sleeve, guys. Does, does this look like a normal sleeve to you? It looks like there's actually something in his shirt. Look at that, how tight it is around the arms. That's not suspicious to you, but anyways. Okay, so he's going to spend six months in space with no breathing room in his arms. I guess he's going to wear that shirt until it falls off of him, because that's what they say they do. All right, we'll see what more lies he comes up with. So thank you again for your well wishes, Mom. I hope I can bring the country together to celebrate Britain in space and our great tradition of scientific exploration. And before I sign off, I'm not sure that this has ever been said in space before. It's not being God said now. Chance. God save the Queen. Oh my goodness. Look at this lying weasel face. Anyways, guys, this is just one of the main, uh, excuse me, this is just one of the many examples of these crisis acting astronauts speaking in front of a green screen. If you just flip your computer upside down and watch these videos, the ones that are like this, you can clearly see that they're just being suspended. Now, some of the other videos, they actually make in a vomit comet where it emulates zero gravity. Now, those clips are very short. Many of them are spliced together as well. But when they do these clips where they're just speaking directly and it's more than 45 seconds, um, they have to do it this way because they just can't um, emulate zero gravity longer than 45 seconds. This is bullshit. None of this stuff is here. All of this is just a green screen. Thanks for watching.